what's going on everybody welcome <clears throat> this is uh mo not motel simulator god damn it this is a state agent simulator with the motel update that's what this is and we're going to be bringing it to you here and hopefully today we'll be able to buy a motel make some money now last time we played we were trying our best to buy the ranch which was a million dollars and a million dollars is hard to come by now hopefully hopefully the motel will help us get to a million doll hairs we're gonna have to see why do i feel like this is loud i don't think it is maybe it is i don't know the music's kind of creepy a little bit here right we're running at a resolution of 50 what the frick what are we doing here hang on a sec i gotta show this look at this i'm running out of by default we're running at a resolution of 5220 by 1440 uh no thank you let's just standard just be standard basic bish unlimited frame rate i mean not really but fine fine all right anyways um yeah welcome in everybody this is the update and uh i guess we're gonna find out what that all entails um or you can argue this is a game where we just gamble our life away and we become broke because all we do is hit the blackjack and then we lose and then the wife we take money from her this is a different kind of simulator this is uh ask your wife for money so you can go play blackjack simulator it's it's still like that yeah hello everybody welcome in if you're watching here on youtube if you're watching here on twitch welcome in good to see you hello tom crabtree hello tech anna maria what's going on hello Susie t hello maya welcome in welcome in hello hello <clears throat> hello maggie may how are you welcome in good to see you angel hello angel hello jonathan welcome in jonathan uh hello t hello velvet glove welcome in hello shay how you doing hello shante good to see you welcome in everybody yeah hello wayne hi from new zealand we'll shout out to new zealand hello wayne good to see you hello nikki and t thank you for re-upping resubscribe for two months with your prime hello 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 uh oh what i've done i just done did myself your message says you, there's a message there that i want to read it says if two seconds of heaven oh yeah two seconds of heaven. <laughs> that's right two seconds of heaven let's go right <laughs> welcome in hello welcome in hello hello muhammad good to see you good to see you happy you're streaming this one again one of my favorites oh very good that's good to hear hello game stations hello serenity hello serenity serenity now lady fluffy dragon welcome in hello alex Good to see you. Hello, Z Lover. What's going on? What's going on? Keely, how you doing? Lenny, how you doing? Lenny, Jammy Socks, welcome in. Hello. Yes. Uh, we had a pivot today. Summer Sunshine. Hello, Summer Sunshine. We had to pivot today. And um, if you never... Hey! Lady Fluffy Dragon with a re-up subscription of the Prime for two months as well. Two Mitch... Two months... Not too Mitch. Two months of Twitchy Fluffy. Oh, I love that. I love that indeed. Um, yeah, so... We had a pivot today. Thank you very much, Lady Fluffy Dragon. Thank you very much, T, for re-upping your memberships on Twitch. I appreciate that. We had a pivot today. We were going to play another game today, but obviously I woke up this morning and found out that the playtest was not even available anymore. So no on that. That's all right. It's okay. We'd like to pivot sometime. This was the original uh, original take anyways. But welcome in, everybody. And uh, yeah, uh, also, today will be the last stream. I know if you want to ever like keep up to date with like updates on on me on on the channel on what we're streaming on what's this and that and that and this the greatest and easiest way to keep up to date on all of that is by joining the discord join the discord i keep everything fluid more updates there if you're wondering what, what's this or that or where, what happened to this stream where i thought you were streaming on this time or this or that whatever it might be i update all that in the discord um, you can join the Discord. You can also uh, hit the go down to the description below. Hit the link and all that. That's where all that is. Hello, Sleepy Sloth. Hello, how are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. Hello, Milwack. Milwack, how you doing? What's going on? Welcome in. Hello, Amanda. Good to see you. Yeah, Stevo, how you doing, Stevo? Yeah, but today will be the last stream I do for a week. So, giddy up, giddy up indeed. Here we go. Let's jump in, shall we? 
but don't worry i will be having videos and stuff like that uh posted every single day while i'm gone so you'll have something to watch nonetheless and there's actually a couple of cool things a lot of there's a lot of let's look at because i'm apparently leaving uh during the same time as steam next fest so there's gonna be a lot of let's look at of new games coming up and stuff like that um and it's gonna be great milwak milwak hello thank you for the subscribing on twitch how are you appreciate that thank you very much big ups to you how are you good to see you welcome in that was kind of you indeed i guess we have a hype train going now hello <clears throat> hello face gaming good to see you welcome in yes sub goal wait sub goal wait a sec just gifted a sub thank you t for gifting a sub i appreciate that hello do we complete the sub goal on twitch is that what it says there's like other things that are blocking my 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 vision here did we do that already I, I think we did. Your sub goal of 175 has been completed. All right. GG's. Good job, everybody. One thing about this game is the loading is taking longer every update. Every update comes out. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what do I mean this is the last stream? This is the last stream for a week. I'm going on a break. I'm going to be going on a holiday for a week. So, yeah. Um, that's what I mean by last stream. <clears throat> ba -da 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 -da. I need to find a better way to tab out. That's what I need to do. Arr, tech, thank you for 11 months, 11 months of membership. Hello, how are you? Hoping cans can help me through a long night shift. I'm hoping I can too. Yeah, good to see you. Thank you for the 11 months. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Are we going to load in anytime soon, potentially? Hey, Essie. Hello, Essie. Two hearts, two hearts, love your channel, THX for all the entertainment, two hearts, two hearts. <laughs> Thank you very much for that. I appreciate you, Essie, for the super chat. Big ups to you. I really appreciate that. Um, thank you for this, uh, for the kind words as well. I'm glad that I could provide you some entertainment. Thank you very much. And thank you, Lindor, for following on Twitch too. Hello. Thanks for that. Welcome in. <clears throat> very good. Very good. Hello. This is our wife. So hello. Yes. Best game I love watching was this cooking simulator. And now the supermarket love that one. You threw the bread away. I, I did. I did not actually. No, I didn't. <laughs> I refuse to think I thrown the bread away. How oh, dare you? But yes. Thank you very much, Essie. Thank you very much. Hello, Freya. How are you? So first things to do in the morning here is obviously go get our rent. Go get our rent. Collect our money. And then what, what the, I forgot. Nobody has clothes on in this game. All right. Hello, Elizabeth. Uh, you collected the rent for all these places. Thank you, Elizabeth. All right. Hello, Barclay. Hello, Mark. How's it going? Happy Saturday. Yeah. Wait. Yes, happy Saturday. I don't know what day it is anymore. I don't. And Lindor, thanks for subscribing on Twitch, too. Hello. Thanks for the follow and the tier one sub. What's going on? Good to see you. Hello. Ermac, how you doing, Ermac? Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Native beauty. Good afternoon. Yeah. Good to see you. Good to see you. Um, so we have quite a few things going on. One, we have three cars. Uh, we have the truck with a bunch of furniture in it, which actually reminds me. Um, let's, well, no, we'll use the truck. I was say, let's park the truck and use the other cars that we have, but it's fine. It's fine. Hello, Alexander. Hello, Baby Spice. How are you doing? Welcome in. Lady Fluffy Dragon says, I spent today playing No Place Like Home with cans playing Dave the Diver in the background. My cans chicken has a full heart now. Oh, oh, sorry. I thought that was a euphemism. I see now. Nice. Okay, nice. I love that. Very cool. <laughs> All right. So I don't know why I instinctively came here. Let's step away. <clears throat> step away. Step away. All right. Go to the motel. So this is the whole update um, that we were talking about. Uh, you can now get in, get in a hotel here at the... Uh, Grand Rock Casino. No, the Grand Rock Motel. Why does Grand Rock Casino sound like a real place? Is there a Grand Rock Casino, potentially? This motel will run you $100,000. I now own the hotel. Okay. Hello? $20,000? Nice. Room? Room one for me? Hello, Hectic Xenon. How are go how's it going? Good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, very well. You drive as bad as my half Lindor. Wait, what? 
as as my other half, Lindor. Oh, very good. In ATS. Oh, man. Okay, listen. You think I drive bad in this? Don't even imagine how I drive in ATS. When I get the pedal, when I get the steering wheel pulled down, and I get to the ATS. Look, even when it comes to eye racing, eye racing I'm pretty good at. ATS. You better watch the hell out. That's all I'm saying. I got a delivery to make. Um, yeah, so I guess we'll go ahead and let them uh, build that little shack over there, which is going to be the Motel Hotel Holiday Inn. Computer-wise, I guess we can. We have like a whole other menu going on here, too. This is really cool. I'm digging it. Uh, income report. You can see your income report. Ledger. Uh, employees. Right. Reception. Cleaning officer. Security officer. Why do we need security, I wonder? Adverts. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, we'll get to this uh, when, um, you know, they're done building. Yeah. We'll get to this when they're done building. It should take them a day or two. I don't know how long this is going to take them. Can I pay them to go faster? Yeah, can I pay you to break some OSHA violation? Maybe. I don't know. Potentially. Potentially. Mm, you Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> Even while driving. All right. Let's go take a look and t make sure that our other places are operable. If not, we can at least... Um, take a little bit of a peek inside all right I, I have to i'm so sorry i know i know you're disgusted with me i get it i understand you're disgusted with me but this has to be done i can't drive past it and not do this right and i just can't hello horse look here lady ten thousand thirty thousand dollars This is actual shit. All right. All right. I deserve it. Look, if if I'm not... Look, listen. Don't feel bad for me because it's my fault. If I don't learn my lesson, I'll never learn. Right? Right? If the blackjack table lady dealer doesn't spank me in money, who's going to spank me? Don't raise your hand. Nobody in the chat raise your hand. Please, for the love of God. Um... You know, I gotta, I gotta make, I gotta make mistakes. Mistakes were, were make, were made, right? Yes. Don't clip that either. Um, it has to be done. I have to learn by mistake. That's not a mistake. By the way, last time we played, we did get a collectible. We did. Yeah. This would be the Cannes Grand Hotel. I agree. I agree. Uh, let's see here. Let me go pick up our cars. That's what I'm kind of doing. I, I want to kind of bring all the cars back to the, uh, back to the house. So we got to walk on over to the Santa Claus one and we'll take that one. And then we'll take the, uh, Paul Walker car back to the house as well. We'll do a little bit of car collecting. Yeah. What's a break? A fence. That's, that's, that's what we should just, that's the fence. The fence is a break. If you ever need a break, use the fence. That's it. Yeah. 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 Look at that son of a gun. I wonder if you could actually win the race with this car. Probably, right? Oh, shit. <laughs> actually, let me properly park this. There we are. There you go. All right, let's go get our other car now. Hello, potato. Hello, potato. Dun, 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 dun. Nothing like a handbrake to destroy your own car. That's exactly right. I miss Twisted Metal. I haven't played Twisted Metal since the PS2, man. Maybe the PS1. Maybe it was a PS1. Maybe it was the last time I played Twisted Metal. Okay, come on in. There we are. It'd be cool, actually. No, I've just thought about this. How come in this game you can't actually like get a bigger house, different house? Maybe not necessarily a bigger house, but maybe like a different house. We can get like houses and everything for everyone else, but we can't even do it for our own self, right? We can't even get a driveway. It's all grass, dude. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, let's go inside. Wife? Wife? Hello? Try to ask her for money. I did lose that blackjack. New rule. If I lose that blackjack, I come ask her for money. I think that's already been a rule, but here we are. Um, what are you doing? Um, it will be a while. What do you want? Um, I have something on my mind. What kind of things? Oh, shoot. With the space bar, dude. Um, I want to have children with you. No, I want to be with you tonight. Follow me, my love. Oh, here we go. Uh-huh. Yep. Thank you, Dwight Schrute. 
Yeah, all right. I'm not asking. I'm going to I'm going to do this and then I'm going to ask her for money. That's how we're going to do. We're going to be serious pimping right now. Everyone close your eyes. Don't close your eyes. No, that's the time to close your eyes. Okay, thank you. $60,000 due to my bad habit. Okay, after I did that, now I talk to you and I say, give me money. Welcome, darling. Was your day exhausting? It was fine. How was yours? Not bad. Very well. Um, can you give me some money? Yeah, darling, I can give you $1,096. Well, thank you. All right, there we go. We hit it. Then we get a nice little paycheck. And then we go to bed. You can only sleep at night. Oh, my God. Did you hear that? I thought I got double moan. I thought I got double moan. I'll be honest with you. Okay. Never mind. We're good. I thought I got a uh, fake moan. <laughs> All right. On we go. And I do wonder if the motel is kind of done already. Let's see. Oh, I forgot we can pick up trash. <sighs> we should just hire a cleaner out here. Uh, metal. Glass. Also glass. And paper to go along with that. Hello. Perfect. Good to see you. Welcome. Uh, hello. Yes. 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 My assistant. Yes. Thank you for all that. No problems at all. Thank you. We actually are very close to a million dollars, so it's all right. We're going to, we're going to, we'll probably actually, I wonder if we'll get the farmhouse today too. We might get both. We might get hotel, motel, holiday in and a farmhouse. Hello, little devil to you. How's it going? She was definitely faking it. Don't ever say that again. Wait, today is, oh, I thought today was Wednesday. Let's say auction day. Yeah. Yeah. We need to look out for auction day. We have a bunch of stuff in our in our back pocket right now. I wonder, do we decorate the motel rooms or are they going to come already decorated? Thank you. Are you guys done yet over here? Hi. Hey. 96%. Okay, I, I would like to, 97%. I would like to think that this first motel room will be done and we will be good. And then I have to figure out how to put people in here. Um, at least rent it out and stuff like that. I wonder if we actually get to, um, you think we get to, uh, like interview people. <laughs> you know how we interview people for houses. Do we get to interview people for hotel rooms? Now that would be so strange. If we like, could you mag imagine walking into a Hilton and be like, okay, here's an interview for you to rent out my uh, two queen bedroom, one room, uh, one bath room on floor 317. Hello. Edit porch dot PSD. The Grand Rock. Hello. Dirty value. Wow, this is actually really cool. Nice. All right. All right. This is tiny as hell. Look, what is this? this is a motel out of like the 90s. This is not a motel out of the 90s. This is a motel out of like 2007, 2008. They didn't have this big box in the 90s. They had, like, even older ones, maybe. I mean, they had these boxes, and then I'm not saying they didn't, but I'm saying the common, like, how common it was for a hotel to, motel to have, motel to have this. There's a difference between motel and hotel, right? So, um, yeah. Um, this is, like, 2007. This is, like, you come in here. Look, look, look. This is, watch, you ready? Ah, look, it's a Grand Rock uh, Hotel. Wait, yeah. <laughs> Hang on. <clears throat> ah, look, honey, it's the Grand Rock Hotel. This is something we've wanted to do for so long. I'm so glad that I'm able to bring you here on my $7.50 minimum wage hour job where we can afford our house in 2007. This is wonderful. I got inspired by National Lampoon Vacation. Now we can go on a vacation to Grand Rock and we can go see the Grand Canyon right down the road. Okay, let's go. This is our motel. Doesn't this look so nice and quaint? I love this so much. Uh-oh, honey. I just got an email from my boss. Looks like the economy is going to crash in 2008. We're all fucked. I mean, that's not exactly how it went, but... You could probably sense something there. By the way, look at that car. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Very well. Okay, uh, dirty value is good. Uh, can we build another one? Can we? Yeah. Twenty thousand. Keep it coming. Uh, I also need to eat some food. There we go. 
eat some fries. Thank you. Okay, we'll get that rolling. Now let's see if we can rent this out. Hello, Punzi. How's it going? Good to see you. <laughs> as it sell, yeah, as it says, welcome, honey, to this motel. As it says, for sale out front, with no freaking anything going on outside. Okay, rooms. Room one. Room is available. Okay, good. I'm glad that the room is available. That makes me happy. Um, employees. Uh, receptionist takes care of hotel customers. Get hired. Responsible for hotel cleaning. Get hired. Security offer. Responsible for hotel security. Get hired. Advertisements. 50, 50, 50, 50. I mean, buy them all. Right? All right. Let's see our, let's see our people now. Okay. There. Oh God. I don't know if I would want to like, what is this? A hotel check-in for the back rooms? Um, oh, this is our maid. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Housekeeping. Yes. I mean, would you be upset if she showed up to your housekeeping duties? Uh, your security. Welcome, honey, to the um, Grand Rock where this guy is out here. Wait, is that me? Is that Dwight? No, that is not Dwight. Hello, boss. Is everything all right? There's no problem. Okay, good. Have a good day. Let's talk to the other employees, yeah? At least the maid has clothes on. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see what happens. Maybe they'll. this is like automated. Is this like less hands-on, more automation? Oh my god, the first person we rent out the motel to is someone who is actually naked. All right. I am the owner of the hotel, therefore, I am allowed to look through your window. It's your fault you're not shutting the blinds. I'm sorry. I know, that banging next door is ridiculous, huh? The racket. Crazy. Am I right? That is actually going to drive me nuts. Is this all you do? Is all you do is stare in the mirror and then you step outside? All right. Well, at least we're making money, I guess. I think. I don't know. Okay. My lord, I gotta get out of here before my eardrums actually burst. What the hell is going on over here? What a Nissan GT decided to mount a police cruiser. I gotta get the hell out of here. All right. Sorry. Lord, how am I supposed to have a honeymoon with that? <laughs> how am I supposed to have a Well, actually, the banging goes with the banging, so they never know if you're actually banging, right? <laughs> oh my god. I'm just cruising. That was my bad. I need to hang on. Let me fix my settings. I need to see if there's a. Uh, there, there is no like borderless mode. Oh, frick. Okay, fine. There's no borderless mode. That's fine. Whatever. It is what it is. It is what it is. Hello, Succubus. How is it going? Welcome in. Ah, all right. All right. Well, we got the motel up and running. That's what matters. And guess what? I didn't stop at the blackjack. Progress. Okay. Oh, I didn't feed potato either. Sorry, potato. I don't think there's like... I don't know how to pull it up again. The L F J N M E Q T Y Y it's Y. I think everything is taken care of, right? Yeah. Everything's taken care of. So the farm skills I would like to do. So since we have the motel running, I would like to get the farm in today too. That's gonna be the, the main goal. And actually it's gonna be a doable go doable goal. Doable goal. Doable go <sighs> not a doable goat. A doable goal for sure today. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Hello? Ding. Wow, our wife did not move that entire time. Good for you, sweetie. Out we go. We have eight houses under our belt because we are an absolute G. Pull out. 
that's how cars made i'm sorry was there like a cars movie i'm not uh not aware of there we go okay hey autumn thanks for subscribing on twitch how are you autumn with your prime as well hello thanks for using your prime on me there's millions of content creators out there and the fact that you guys use your prime subscriptions on me is amazing i appreciate that thank you all like we're almost bringing in a hundred thousand dollars a day just let alone on 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 just like rent right it's pretty good now i wonder how i'm supposed to like collect the money from uh on like collect the money from the hotel motel motel not hotel i gotta you gotta say it correctly motel not a hotel motel there's a difference between motels and hotels in case people didn't know there's a difference between motels hotels and resorts okay wait a sec <laughs> damn that was fast wait did you put clothes on i'm so confused what's going on here are you someone different i am confused ah there's so much happening sir did i get paid <laughs> Oh, I did $2,200. Damn, dude. Hey, you're telling me I'm charging $2,200 a night? $2,200 a night. This must be a nudist colonist or something. This must be top premium where they're like, yeah, I feel comfortable and you let me be naked around here. I don't even serve breakfast. I don't even have like continental free breakfast. What do you mean $2,200 a night? what what is the difference between motel and hotel okay the rooms on the outside motel rooms on the inside hotel easiest way to kind of think of that easiest way to think of that the rooms on the outside of the outside it's not indoors motel room on the a room on the inside hotel Let's go see if we can throw some furniture in a, in, in a, in a, in a, in a, in a house. Or let's see if we can buy ourselves another house. Yeah. Almost, almost all motels have them on the ground floor. If mostly motels are ground floor on the ground floor, but, uh, there are some that are on like they they, they have like two floors. Yeah. It's, it's, it's usually one or two floors. It's never like more than two floors though. Okay, let's see what's for sale, shall we? Actually, let's take a look at our map real quick. No, I didn't say ground floor. Not up. Okay, let's go there. Let's go there. Perfect. Hey, Crazy Magic, thanks for resubscribing on Twitch with your two months with Prime. Say, hey, all, there's a new neighborhood too, I believe. That's what happens when I'm driving and texting. There's a new neighborhood. A new neighborhood, you say? A new district. Let's see. What the hell does this mean? Two days, seven hours? If there's a new neighborhood, then it must be somewhere that I am not looking. Potentially. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I almost hit her. I know, right? <laughs> Hello, Moon Bunny Anna. How are you, Anna? How are you doing? Good to see you. All right, here's our house. We need to kind of get let it going. All right, go. Oh, trash. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I crashed the game for a sec. That would have been really scary. Unless there's like some new district, unless there's like updates coming soon for the new district or something rather. We need to fill this bad boy with a bunch of furniture, by the way. Uh, whoops. Did not mean to do that. Put that away. Uh, why, what are these supposed to be? Were these always empty? I guess so, maybe. Mm, you're still drawing. Oh, very well. By the way, anybody that ever sees, like, a lot of my art on, like, Instagram and Twitter, that's all, uh, Moon Bunny Anna. That's all Anna on, uh, over that's chatting on Twitch. Incredibly talented. I love all the artwork she does. There we go. There we go. Roach. 
I don't like the roaches. It's like my least favorite part. But I'm a picky son of a gun, so that is what it is. Oh, speaking of roaches, did you see... I don't know if anybody follows Asmongold, but... That mother effer. That mother effer makes millions and millions and millions of dollars streaming. Millions of dollars streaming. And he was caught, I think, yesterday with a roach climbing on him. On his body. Did anybody see that clip? Like, what the frick, man? Like, not saying, like, I don't know. I know he lives a simple life and all, but my guy. You can't be having cr roaches climbing on you when you're streaming. That's just... There, there has to be some boundary. You know what I mean? There has to be some boundary. I like Asmund. Don't get me wrong. I do. I like... I, I think he's entertaining. But I also think Roaches is not entertaining. You know what I mean? I mean, he is super popular for the person that made a $5 steak. Walmart. That's how he lives. You know, I know I get it. I know how he lives, but I'm just saying, man. No cockroaches, please. No cockroaches. Hello, Allison. How are you? Why am I putting two tables in here? There we go. I might take that table out. <sighs> he has some weird priorities. That's the best way to put it. Yeah, weird priorities. <laughs> weird priorities. There you go. There we go. Hey, roaches. Can the disgusting can never get rid of them? Remember them crawling on me when I slept in the old apartment. Ooh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I don't like I don't like I don't like roaches. I don't like like spiders and stuff like Some people say most spiders are harmless. Yeah, but like they're spiders. So like no Like I don't know what's they're they're like a species that has like a million eyes They're watching everything man What are you talking about? They're just harmless they're watching you. They're they're expecting you to put your guard down. That's what I think. And they attack. Right? I don't mean to gross anybody out, but I think they say, and I don't know if this is true or myth. Maybe somebody watching is no knows if this is true or myth. But like true or myth, like they say the average human in their lifetime will swallow like two spiders while they're sleeping. Again, don't know if it's true. I'm just reporting what was reported. I'm doing like the half ass report. There you go. You know what I mean? That's what I'm doing. Yeah. I do have another. When I get. So, in case you're coming in late here today, um, I, this will be my last stream today for a week because I'm going on holiday. I'm going on break. But when I get back. Shit. When I get back, I do have a simulator game I am going to be playing, and I'm very excited about it. Plus, I won't say what it is because I don't, I don't like to ruin surprises. Plus, we will also, uh, when I get back, we'll be very, very, very close to, like, a lot of, like, simulators that are releasing here very soon, too, as well. So, when I get back from stream, or when I get back from holiday, we will, um have quite a bit of uh of, of simulators coming out towards the end of this month and in the middle of this month it's gonna be uh, quite fun i'm very excited i like i love the simulator genre i do i do love the simulator genre it does get oversaturated sometimes with like projects that are just like not good <laughs> just to put it bluntly but um yeah yeah it's it's all good fun for the most part no it's, that table there is weird. Hello, creatives. How are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. Yes. February 22nd needs to hurry up. See, that's a, exactly a prime example right there. Also, another prime example is Liz. Thank you, Liz, for subscribing. Hello. Thanks for using your prime subscription on me. I appreciate that. Good to see you. Hello. Welcome in. There we go. I don't like using this as a computer chair, but I guess I'm going to have to. Keisha, with the 12 months, the full one year of support. Hello, let me hit you with this. 
Thank you very much, Keisha. Big ups to you. Says you need a break, but it will be a, sadly a long week. <laughs> yeah, I should be back around the 9th or 10th. 9th. Probably the 9th. Don't hold your breath, though. Uh, but yeah. But I will have some really cool, like, um, I'll have some, um, there we go. I'll have some cool videos coming out every day while I'm gone, too. We're going to be doing a lot of Let's Look at and stuff like that. There actually will be a simulator, uh, I think, a simulator game that we're going to be, uh, a video that I will be posting uh, while I'm gone, too. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, I don't have a kitchen counter, which is throwing me off here. There we go. Okay, three more items to get that full 20. Yes. Hello, Maris. Good afternoon to you, Maris. Welcome in. Laundry basket. <clears throat> I hope there are many new and exciting simulator games coming soon. I have an idea for my own, but not sure how to make them. Yeah, um, there are quite a bit. There's quite a bit, actually. There is quite a bit coming very soon. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's going to be great. I think so. It's going to be real good. Let's put this over here. There we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, Susie can take over. We'll just put Susie on the live stream while I'm gone. That will be that. Yep, I agree. That's a fantastic idea. I think that's something we need to do. Yep, I agree. Yep. Yep. I think we should make a petition for that. I think so. I think that just makes sense, doesn't it not? Yeah. We'll have the co-pilot take over. Leader one, red one, red leader one. Is that what it is? Hello? Red leader two. Yeah. Hello, Carrie. How are you? Oh, whoops. Okay. Are we good? Is that 20? Yeah. Oh, 20, 20. All right. Go. Okay, let's take a picture real quick. Uh, camera. Oh, look, there's motel now on there. Wait, cleaner? Items info? Wait, cleaner? Whoa, what is this? Oh, wait, can you... A cleaning agency for your houses? Oh, I see now. Nice. I see. So this is new. Cleaner for your houses. Cleaning time, 15 minutes. Oh, I love this. Good thing we have a bunch of XP stacked. So we have a reason to actually use our XP now. Nice. We have Aria. Cleaning time, 15 minutes. House number 15. Okay. <laughs> right. Picture. Whoops. Whoops. Tablet. Uh, web. 15. Oh, there's already a thing there. $8,000. Okay. $9,000. Send it. Okay, that's going to be added. We're going to be doing that tomorrow. All right, let's go to the casino. I think it's casino time. I did enough work uh, for today. Whoops. Mm -hmm. Does anybody have an idea what to draw? I'm drawing for a while, but I want to make something different. I actually did have an idea. A few days ago. But then I forgot what the idea was. I think it was your drawings that gave me the inspiration for an idea. And then I forgot what it was. 50,000? 19? Actually stay? Suck on that? Walk away. We're going to get that ranch, baby. We're going to get that ranch. Good to see you, Barclay. Yeah, it's good to see you. I hope you're well on this Saturday. Hopefully it's not too cold. It's cold where I'm at. It's cold and rainy, too. I hate it. It's going to be raining on my holiday. And all I got to say is F the forecast. Ba -bum -ba -da -bum -bum -bum. I love that you get, I think 30 skill points for refilling the dog's food bowl is like a lot, but you know, 
that's fine. I'll, you know, it is what it is. It's a lot. I mean, you really don't have to do anything for 30 XP, right? 30 skill points. Did I just lose or win at the casino? I just won. Yeah, I won a hundred thousand. Well, I won fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, incredible time, right? Did anyone see a horse in there, or was that me? That's yeah. No, there's a horse in there. That's my horse. I put the horse in the blackjack or in the casino. It's for good luck. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I do have a horse in there. I didn't know where else to put the horse. I wasn't gonna put the horse in the garage, so I decided to put the horse in the casino. I think that made the most sense. Hello? Uh, 55,000? Appreciate that. Next. 34,000? Thank you. We are almost at $1 million. Hello, sir. Would you like to rent this house out? You're in a bit of a hurry. How can I help you? I want to rent this house for 10 days. Uh, 9,000? Fantastic. All right. Fine. All right. All right. So we got that house rented out. Is there another house that we need to get? There's other houses we could buy. Uh, it's today Wednesday. Today's not Wednesday. I will wait until Wednesday uh, before I uh, get another house, I think, so that we can get the auction and the furniture and all that. Hello, Cheryl. How are you? Welcome in. Hello, Crystal Nicole. What's going on? How are you? Welcome in. Uh, let's see here. Get the F out of my way. I'm trying to get to my motel. Dun, 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 dun. You're surprised the customers didn't run away. <laughs> Thank you, Moon Bunny, for the hydration. I just saw that, too. I'm a little late. I'm like 13 minutes late, but cheers to you. I just saw that. <laughs> 49 degrees is not bad. Hey, that's warmer than where I'm at. Oh, look at that. Double fisting on the Motel Hotel Holiday Inn. Next. Okay. Uh, hello, I'm here to collect my money. Thank you. Actually, room-wise... Okay, they're not dirty. Okay. I think the one thing I would have to say, though, about some of these simulator games... And I, we've kind of learned about it with Movie Cinema sim Simulator when we played that. Is that these, these simulator games... It comes to a point where... Um, you're very, very less hands-on. And, like, everything is, like, automated, right? If we can find a way to bridge the gap where, yes, our lives get easier, but there's also other avenues to make ourselves, like, more involved with the business, I think that would go a long ways. But I think most of these simulators, it really gets to the point where it's like, well, you're only, like, you know, <laughs> you're only, um, you're only working to make everything automated, which, I don't know, maybe some people really like or something, but I think, for me, after that, it just gets to the point where it's like, well, like, what's the point, you know? What is going on here? It's like, okay, and then you're just kind of like, all right, that was fun, right? But if I could be more involved and be, like, a rich CEO, that would be kind of cool. How much are you offering this house? $27,000? Um, to be honest, that price scares me a little. I'm actually just lying, but... I will give you $15,000. It's not possible if you already accept it. You should offer more. Okay. Um, I will give you $17,000. Okay. I will give you $19,000. $19,000. You are an absolute dick. Fine. Be on with yourself. Hello, Liz again. How are you, Liz again? Liz, over on YouTube now. Going from Twitch to YouTube. I see you. Oh, God. I see you. I want that house. Dark Vanilla P. Vanilla P. Vanilla P. Thanks for following on Twitch. Hello. She's Scarlet. Scarlet. What the frick? This house is $8,000? That seems so low. Um, this is more expensive than I thought. 
And what if I gave you five thousand dollars? Can I pay you five? Sorry, I cannot accept this offer. You should do more. Um, how about I give you uh, sixty? Frick me, sixty-five hundred. Can I give you sixty-five hundred for this? Unless you have a higher price, you can go. All right. Um, what if I gave you seven thousand dollars? Leave it. Take it or leave it, lady. All right. Cool. Nice. All right. Let's just throw some stuff in there. As we have some stuff. We have another house. Oh, God. It's dirty in here, too. Uh, whoops. Forgot to clean it. There we go. There we go. There we are. Open up. <clears throat> oh, God. Roaches. Send it. Uh, give me... I don't understand what this... Like, you dirty bastards. Quit being so dirty. Clean up after yourselves. How dare you? <clears throat> I'll call the cleaner. Well, look at me. See, this is... <laughs> I guess this kind of goes into the exact thing I was just talking about. Like, me being more hands-on. I'm like, oh, I, I want things to be more hands-on. And then it'd be like, oh, yeah. And then call the automated service, right? I know, right? I'd be... <laughs> it's like... <sighs> Right, right. Where's the uh, three percent at? Am I missing three percent? Maybe I'll call the cleaner for this. Can you actually just like call him up? Be like, "Yo, come get me." Five hundred and twenty-five dollars for four percent. All right. Okay. Sure. Sure, brother. There we go. All right. Add more stuff. Um, what is this? Wrong way. Also, the very, very wrong way. Perfect. All right. Continue. Mm -hmm. Microwave. I'm going to put that on the ground. I got no, I got no counter. I got no kitchen counter. What am I supposed to do? I got nothing. There we are. I got nothing. Nothing, nothing. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Um, real quick. I need to like get rid of there we go, finally. Thank you for the hydration too. Uh dark vanilla. Hello. Cheers to you. It's a playway game. You have to clean. Uh no. This is not a playway game, but almost. <laughs> if you mean like the publisher playway, no, it's not a playway game. <laughs> There we go. Mm -mm -mm. I am always holding up traffic in the... Well, look at that. They disappear. I'm not... Look at... I have enough room. I'm on the curb. He had enough room to drive. He had all the room to drive. I'm not putting this on rent yet. So that's why we're leaving it. Hey, subscriber. Thanks for subscribing. Ah! Appreciate it. By the way, you can drive through trees in this game too. <laughs> oh, very good very good i don't know what that marker's for i don't know why it's being all weird cops giving you a ticket well you know you know i've never gotten a parking ticket in my life i've only gotten one traffic infraction ever ever believe it or not i know i drive like an absolute asshole in these games it's only because i don't get to do that in real life you know i've never been pulled over I've never even... The only way I got a ticket was because they caught me on camera. That's it. Other than that... That's it. Why is that highlighted now? I don't know. Uh, wife, do you want to watch a movie with me tonight? Would you like to watch a movie? Uh, Waiting for you. When will you be done? Washing ditch dishes? Not j ditches. Keep me busy. Um... Um, I'm going to sleep. Come to bed with me when you're done. Okay, well, I guess I wanted to watch a movie with her, but I guess I'll watch one by myself. There we go. We'll watch Half Life. Yeah. Exhilarating. Yeah. 
Just leave his blinker on? Yeah, there you go. Leave your blinker on. Very well. Leave it on. You'll be good. Hello, Ryan. How's it going? You used to have so many non-sober adventures in Soho. I beg your pardon? <clears throat> How do you take a parking ticket over from being sick? Wait, is this like a like a knock knock joke question ask thing? Is this like like knock knock who's there type type of question? I don't what? <laughs> <laughs> Soho is the new neighborhood. Go to the bus stop. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. I got pulled over once for blowing my nose at a red light. You should have handed him the snot rag and been like, take this, bitch. <laughs> Sixty one K. All right. Oh, house 15 didn't pay. That's my new house, right? I think that was my new house. I'll talk to them. <clears throat> 19,000. Okay. Um, it can be yours. It can be. Um, yeah. All right. Is today Wednesday yet? No. All right. We'll go give a talking talking to this guy. In real life, it's a district in London that used to have nightclubs, bra bars, I thought that said bras, and music venues. That's my break. Hello, Edward. You just rented out this house and you're not paying already. I came to take the rent. I have no money. I will pay the rent later. <sighs> Absolutely not. You'll pay the rent. Forget it. I don't have the money right now. I will pay the rent later whenever I want. I'll sue you. Pay the rent or leave the house. Mind your own business. I'm not paying the rent since I don't have any money. I can't deal with it. Beat up and take the money. Tell that you'll sue or should I beat him up? I don't think I've actually used the sue thing mechanic in this game. So maybe I do that. Yeah. Sue or take the money. Sue or take the money. I kind of want to fight him, though. All right, I'll sue him. I'll see you in court. Go to the court? Wait, what do you mean, go to the court? You mean go to the attorney's, like, shack? <laughs> hey, Puck, how you doing? What's going on? Good to see you. Hope you're well, yeah? You don't want me to fight him? You want me to sue him? Okay, right. We'll sue him. We'll sue him. Sir? <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hello, I'm fine. How are you? Thank you. How can I help you? My client is not paying the rent. I want to sue them. Edward. You have to pay $300 in legal fees. I can afford that. Okay, I'm starting the necessary procedures and I will... I, I didn't get to read the rest of that, but sure. All right. We're suing. I guess that's, that's happening right now. And I got an achievement for it, so there you go. That's how you know I didn't uh, do it. Oh, I'm almost out of gas, dude. Oh, shoot. Nobody was watching my uh, fuel tank, even though I'm the one that's driving this bitch. My bad. I think I just ran out of gas. Coast it, coast it, coast it, coast it, coast it, coast it, coast to coast. Oh! Love it. Let's go. You started your new job two weeks ago. Wait. About two weeks ago. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome news. That's so exciting. I hope you're loving it, yeah? Okay, we'll go to the bus stop. I should have went at the blackjack, I'll be honest with you. But we'll come back here and go to the bus stop. Soho. It is Soho. What the frick? Wait a sec. Huh? What? Wait a sec. Huh? Am 
I'm a little confused. I'm a little confused. Why? Why do we have a house? Or why do we have how? I don't understand. How am I supposed to get a car over here? How am I supposed to get furniture over here? I don't want to hear the excuse where it will come later. Like, if you put half implementation of the game, of a, of, of a, of a new area, just wait till you're done finishing it. Don't give us this and then be like, oh yeah, we'll add on to it later. I just don't add it. <laughs> Just, what? Is, unless I'm wrong about this. How are you supposed to get furniture over here? If I can't drive over, can I drive over here? Is this a possibility? I'll give you $8,000 for it. Yeah. Eighty five hundred. You're loving the address, sixty two. Okay. Some gals want to hear it, it will come. Excuse me. Cleaner. Okay, I cannot clean up. Oh. Oh, she, it takes, okay, all right, shit. X amount of time, right, okay. 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 I still don't understand. Um, <clears throat> can we drive here? Map? What the frick? Wait, can you not drive? What is this? I don't understand. What is this? Said Notting Hill. Yeah, I was going to play something else, Glorious, but uh, unfortunately the playtest uh, closed this morning before I could play it. Yeah. Um. Like, what's the point of buying a house out here? Hello, Lena. How are you? You can drive. Follow your road from your house? You think I can drive here? What? Where? What? No way. Seriously? We're driving. Yeah, you did not imagine it. <clears throat> no, you did not imagine it at all. This seems so empty. <laughs> what game am I playing now? I went to the Wildflower stream. Um, it was supposed to happen a couple of days ago. The update... Uh, didn't come out because they didn't give us an exact date and I ran out of time. So I had a whole day planned to do two, uh, two streams of it. You can drive out here. Uh, but, um, the developers never gave us an exact time when I thought it was going to be like early third, early on the 31st, but it didn't happen. So yeah, that's what happened. Ran out of time. This is interesting. Um, Interesting indeed. Uh, what the frick? Oh, sh oh, okay, okay. Now, wow, why doesn't the new area show up on the map though? That's what confuses me. Oh. So we can get, are you serious? You're joking, aren't you? Why don't I turn off my signal light? That's a very good question. <laughs> Why 
Why is my signal light on? <laughs> um. Got it. <laughs> oh, dude, I have some ideas brewing in my head. Not that. I have some ideas brewing in my head with like those hills and stuff. With like, if we can get like a really fast car, right? I see some potential there. There's some potential there. I see it. I see the potentials. Don't don't mind me, baby. Got a text from the wife. Hang on. What did she say? What the frick? Are you effing kidding me? Okay, so I'm supposed to leave tonight, right? I just got a notification on my phone saying... We are expecting a high wind warning with gusts of wind to 50 to 60 miles an hour. Local gusts up to 65 miles an hour. When? 9 a.m. Sunday morning. All the way to Monday, 10 a.m.? It's going to be 25 hours long. Expect impacts, damaging winds will blow down trees and power lines. Widespread of power outages are expected. Why? Why? Why does this have to happen now? This is from the Na National Weather Service announcement. 34 minutes ago. Are you effing kidding me? Hang on a sec. Jesus Christ. Okay. <clears throat> you got the same thing here? And you're from California? Yeah, see? Local gusts up to 65 miles an hour. Either, look, I'm flying out of Sacramento. 65 miles an hour wind are coming into Sacramento tomorrow morning, which is the time I leave. <clears throat> Either they'll delay the flight, cancel the flight, or it's going to be a bumpy ride tomorrow morning. And I don't know which one it's going to be. Yeah. Don't know which one it's going to be. Guess we'll find out tomorrow morning. Bowie. Also, thank you, Cyrus, for gifting out a member or gifting out a subscriber on Twitch. Hello. How are you? 65 miles an hour. What are we in a freaking hur hurricane? All right. Very well. You can fly a kite. Well, there you go. All right. <laughs> that's one thing. That's one thing to... That's a, that's a good thing to, to think of. <laughs> hey, if anything, we'll be able to fly sideways. Ah, <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. 
It's one thing. It's always one thing after another, isn't it? It is. It's always one thing. I can't like I can't do anything just like without no problem. There 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 always has to be some sort of problem. By the way, we need to re-up our um our houses. Is this one of them? No. Next one. 65 is a light breeze. No, it's not. Not when you live in a friggin' uh, environment, climate where you don't are you, you where you're it's like look it's like oh the uk doesn't need air conditioning yeah it's a place that's built that doesn't need air conditioning because they for over time have built an entire economy or or lifestyle climate where they never needed air conditioning right it's like yeah we live in an area where there's massive amounts of trees and there's a valley that shows potentially little tornadoes coming through we're not prepared for that you think we have uh, houses upon houses that have basements we don't have basements we don't have that kind of thing we don't have structure around that yeah anyways this is going to be going up for sale okay this is um hang on a sec what is this address eight uh, okay eight there's no way there's no wait i'm into all of our why is there no furniture in there we didn't get robbed did we or did we just rent that out with no furniture we might have rented it out with no furniture in it I just realize there's no furniture in it exactly that's exactly it yeah, we needed it two years ago when we hit 42 degrees. Exactly, right? So when you're like, oh, we're not built for this. We're not built for 65 miles an hour wind. Just as much as you're not built for 42 degree weather. We're not built that way. We're built in a different way. We're ready for like earthquakes and stuff. We're, we're, we're ready for earthquakes. Arguably, terribly ready for uh, wildfires built for 65 miles an hour wind that's gonna be some shit that's all i gotta say excuse me that's the wrong place remember the snowstorm completely destroyed the power grid look texas is on texas is on a whole nother planet what the hell was that sound okay we'll go Bye. I was going to wait till Wednesday, which is tomorrow, but I'm going to use Wednesday also tomorrow to get us a bunch of other things. But at least for this house, we'll buy something. There we are. Okay. Okay. That, that's not new. Look new. Uh, computer chair, please. Computer chair. Thank you. <clears throat> you know, back in, what was it, like 2017, the UK hit like 30 degree, 35 degree weather. Nobody said anything about that. there but now it's like a phenomenon um what the heck is this oh wow oh this is farm stuff oh cool all right i don't don't remember that is this new bed stuff no I, no this isn't new no that can't be new that's not new no way that's new that couch is new is there new furniture that's new yeah that's new this is new that's new no yes there's some new stuff here. Yeah, there's definitely new stuff. Yeah, this is new. I don't remember any of that. Yeah, this is definitely new. Oh my god. Okay, yeah. We got new stuff here. That's fun. Of course, I'm not going to buy any of the new stuff because I bought all the old stuff. Okay, let's see what we have here. Oh, what the shit. Yeah. <laughs> 
it does snow in Arizona. There's only some areas. I mean, look, if you're in a desert, it's going to snow. That's what deserts do. Desert snow. It gets cold in a desert. That's the whole thing of the biome. That's the whole landscape. It gets cold in a desert. If you live in a desert, it's probably going to snow. Look at Antarctica. It's never hot there, but it's always snowing. That's a desert. There we go. Okay. It gets hot, but it gets cold. It's just how it rolls, right? Desert can be deadly cold at night. Exactly. Go to Las Vegas. It doesn't snow. I, well, I don't know if it snows in Las Vegas, but it snows right on outside Las Vegas. What is this house eight? Yeah, the house eight or house nine? Is that it, this one? This one? No, this one right here. There we go. Okay, so if I go on a rant tomorrow morning, early tomorrow morning in the Discord, there's no why. You've been warned. If I'm like, oh, this is ridiculous. How how could they be? How could they delay the flight and, and tell me that they're trying to look out for my safety? How dare them? Bastards. They're telling me they don't have the confidence to fly in 65 mile an hour wind. Oh, I'm disgusted. I'm disgusted. I'm going to be a real Karen about it. Okay. <laughs> How dare they? Uh, <laughs> the audacity and it also says there's going to be going to Los Angeles and there's going to be we were told that there was going to be massive flooding in LA this 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 week too so that's fun as well can't wait for that it's going to be wonderful can't wait I think it's the flooding starts on Monday. It's got to be fantastic. Can I put this up here? I don't want to put it right there. Oh, God. Oh, the slanted roofs. Oh, I hate the slanted roofs. Slanted roofs. There we go. Perfect. Cheers. Cheers to you, uh, Moon Bunny. Move over, pilot. I've played Flight Simulator. I know what I'm doing. I'll guide us through 65. <laughs> uh, I don't think it'll be a problem. Like, in all seriousness, I don't see it being a problem. But, um... Because, you know, they, they're they pretty good at, like, updating, like, you, like, now. Like, oh, if we know that's going to happen, we're going to update you on your flight. Like, I don't know, less than 48 hours in advance. But, um... Wow, this house is weird. But, um, this door is invisible, too. What the hell? Um, I do think it will be probably a bumpy ride, though. It will be a bumpy ride. At least takeoff will be. And sometimes the Santa Ana winds could get, like, really, like, bumpy, but I don't know. This is, should, should be straight out of North Sacramento. And I believe the airport, the airport is located in North Sac Sacramento anyway, so. You want to see me fly a plane in Flight Simulator? Look, I used to play Flight Sim, on my downtime, I would play Flight Simulator with a friend. He was way better at flying planes than I was. Let's just say that. Yeah.
How dare anyone could be safe? <laughs> ah, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna sit there at like five in the morning in the airport and just, just look around, just look at all the very, very mass angry amounts of Caucasians. Just oh, damn it! Our flight's delayed an hour because they want us they want to keep us safe. This is ridiculous. I want a refund. I want a refund. I want my flight comped and I want five hundred dollars. This is absolutely absurd. Absolutely absurd. How dare they? Did I buy a TV? Nope, oh, wrong way. Ah, I'm sitting here with my freaking Starbucks in my hand on a freaking Sunday because I ain't got nothing better else to do. Oh, I'm traveling back home to see my wife who I pretend is my second wife because my real wife is on the road with me all the time when my real wife doesn't know about it and I'm getting paid $175,000 a year. Oh! Oh, how dare you? 47 minutes delayed? Unnecessary. This is no. Oh, I'm just waiting, dude. It's going to happen. And I'm going to sit there and I'm going to watch it. And it's going to be glorious. And then I'm going to be like, this is why I take breaks. Because I want to see what real people are like in real life. This is wonderful. I'm going to have absolute exclusive entertainment for free. And I cannot wait. If there's anything I like doing, it's people watching. I'm going to people watch the shit out of them tomorrow morning. They better wait. They better wait. Cause I'm coming for you. <laughs> ah, I could go on forever, man. I could keep it coming. to fill you in on the entertainment oh man i will i will i i will absolutely or you know what tomorrow's gonna be a day where i just wake up and we just get on the plane and we go and nothing will happen and then i'll be like all right well remember all that bitching i did in the stream yesterday yeah apparently that was added to nothing there's like certain items i can't put in here like i can't put this in there in here which is sad i can't put this in here i can put this in here okay now I can. <sighs> you take breaks to be able to sit at the airport and complain fun times? Yes, exactly. This is why I live. This is why we live here. Like, come on now. Only makes the most perfect sense. There we go. Too many lights. We're not going to hit the 25 uh, threshold, threshold, threshold. Can I try this again? Yeah. There we go. Okay, cool. Where are we doing our laundry? Right here. <laughs> I want to plane all to myself. How dare you delay me? I want a free ride to anywhere in the world and free peanuts. I'm angry. It's... <laughs> It's the sense of entitlement people have that is just like astonishing sometimes. I think it, I think that alone is like wow. Like I would be sometimes the way people act, I'm just like embarrassed for them, but I know they don't feel any embarrassing because they've been doing it all their whole lives, right? But I'm like, dude, my anxiety and all that, what you're saying and how you're doing that and what you're doing about the situation that's not in any of your control is absolutely insane. Like, what do you, what do you, like, do you get off on that kind of stuff? <laughs> like, you know, 
Like, what is what is the what is the end goal here, right? 20k. Oh, hit me so hard. Thank you, Britney Spears. I win. And I and I walk out. There we go. Just don't get a Boeing 737. I'm trying to think of the plane that we're going to be on. I think it might. I don't know. I got to figure out what plane it is. It's not the. I'm not going on Alaskan Airline if that's what you're getting at. I'm not going on Alaskan Airline. <clears throat> I know, I know all the, all the, the, yeah, 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 that happened and whatnot. I don't even know how you compensate those people when the freaking wall of the plane literally rips off in the middle of a flight while you're flying midair. How do you compensate people on that? Oh, my bad. You almost died. My bad. You almost got sucked out at 600 miles an hour. Whoops. That's our bad. That happened like a few weeks ago. Check out the video. There's a video of it online. That would be one of those incidents where it's like, oh yeah, that happened, but no one can prove it because no one took video of it. No, there was a smart person that day that did take video of it. They're like, oh my God, we need to document this. Good for them. Yeah. Good for them. I have no I, I what are you supposed to do here's a free here's free tickets for the rest of the year auctions open we're going to the auction what are you supposed to do in that situation oops we're gonna buy this freaking ranch here in a sec we're gonna buy it today well actually we might not well maybe we'll buy it today i don't know it depends on how much money we spend at the auction place send therapy bills that's pretty good I like that. <clears throat> Have they added kids yet? Definitely not. Excuse me, ma'am. Here we go. Hello. Ready to do it. Let's get it. Come on. Auction time it is. Did I sleep in midair? I slept on my bed. Am I going to Florida for, for vacation? No, I'm going to California for vacation. <laughs> Don't you live in California? I do. Fluffy Dragon, thanks for gifting out a sub to Moon Bunny, and I see you over there on Twitch. Hello. Hello. Hang on a sec. There's a lot of California to see though. Yeah. I mean, I, and this is like, I, I live here, but like, I also want to like spend time here too. I know a lot of people have a lot of issues to say about California and all that, but look, I know it's expensive to live here and it is very expensive to live here, but you know, damn it. I love living here. It's so nice. Even though how much I complain about the winds, <laughs> the headwinds, um, that and, uh, and, um, what was I going to say? Uh, frick, I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, no idea. I mean, this, the size of California is like the size of the UK, I think, right? Just about. 
I started watching the pumping simulator and missed a couple of videos because the next one I watched, there were like 30 babies walking around. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was uh, that was baby making factory. I got all the auctions off. Thank you. California is far bigger than the UK. I know, like, it's like you guys are like, <clears throat> it's like an entire country is like, how could you not have this like incredible public transportation? Well, because one state is one entire country. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> That's just, there's 50 states. My man, my good guy. Like, I live in a state where it's your entire country. Hot half of your continent, almost. Just, just imagine that, first and foremost. I think the UK has way more population than California. I think California has maybe the third, a third of the population of the UK. I believe. Like, y'all are really bunched up. I have my uh, indicators on again. F. Y'all are living on top of each other. Don't you like get out and want to like breathe a little bit? Like, uh, Z. Okay. Turn off my, turn off my indicators. There we go. Got it. Move over here. Thank you. Can we get an actual big truck? I don't know if you can actually get a big truck in this game. 45 items. There we go. 62 million population there. You think? I don't know what the population is in California. I really don't. I'm not entirely sure. I think there's like... I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Couldn't tell you the population of where we're at. 40 million people in California? God damn. Well, there you go. 40 million people in just the state of California. Not even the country of the United States. And there's 68 million people in the UK. An entire country made up of other countries, right? Or other... <laughs> How does that work? Is it is it a country made up of other countries? Is that what it is? <laughs> or what's the actual, like... What's the, uh, like, the official terminology of that? I don't know what the term... Like, the pr proper terminology is. Madam, madam... You have pubs older than the USA? Look, you have churches older than the USA. You have churches older than almost every country in the world. There was a church that was built for like 700 years, wasn't there? It took 700 years to build a freaking church over there? Imagine that generational timeline. Was that in the UK or was that in Europe? I know Europe, but I'm talking EU, not... UK and I'm not talking continent here. I might complain about New York because it's expensive and sometimes smells horrible, but I love living in New York City. There's nowhere in the world like New York. In New York, concrete jungle where dreams are made of. There's nothing you can't do. Now you're in New York. <clears throat> that was sorry I didn't loosen up the pipes today United Kingdom of Great Britain and North Ireland made up of four countries plus smaller islands so a country that's made up of countries yeah that's the best way to put it can, can we condense that a little bit get some gas while we're here whoa 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 look Cities have our states, cities, states, cities have their own like anthems. Empire State, right? State of mind. What is that? Empire State of mind. Whatever song I was just singing, there's that. And then you have California Love, Tupac. Look, we have our anthems. We know what's going on. What's the UK anthem? Does, does the UK have an anthem? <laughs> or is it like some Beethoven something I've never heard of? <laughs> Is that the anthem? That you call? Is this some like public domain music that we don't, I don't, I've never heard of. 
I have too much fun. They do. California is one of the biggest economies in the world. I think it's the fourth biggest economy in the world. The fourth. Everybody does business out of here. Uh, let's go. God save the queen. Is that the UK anthem? <laughs> ah, shoot. I don't think I said hello, Natasha. Hello, Panic. Hello, Screech Owl. How are you? Good to see y'all. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. There we go. Four more. The national anthem God gave the king as it is now. Wait, that's the national anthem, right? That is. I mean, if you wanted to put California Love as our national anthem, I wouldn't be upset. I know a lot of people would, but I wouldn't. I guess I should have done it. I should have broke it down a little bit. I don't know what they're called. They're not called states in the UK, right? You guys don't have states. What, what are they called? Hey, subscriber. Territories, areas. Hello, Martin. Thanks for subscribing. Oops. Is it true you had to sing the anthem every day at school? Yes. Well, no. We had to sing the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, by liberty and justice for all. I don't think I've said that in probably... Fifteen years, maybe. <laughs> I'd have been fifteen years. I've said that this is the last time I said that. You need to use the Team America World Police America anthem. Okay, that would just be too perfect, though. We don't sing the national anthem. We sing the. Well, I don't know, actually. I don't know how it works nowadays. I could be wrong. I'm not sure how it is in school nowadays, but it used to be like that. We used to have to put, say the uh, Pledge of Allegiance, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe some schools do, depending on what state you live in. I don't know. It could be a very, like, state thing, uh, cultural thing. There's so many other things going on with that, you know. I don't know if they still do it or not. But that was the first thing we did before we did anything. When the bell rang, boom, stand up, boom, salute, boom, done. That was that. They're called counties. Okay, so you guys call them counties. Like, we call counties something else, obviously. Counties are just areas that are... Counties are in states. States are in countries. Our country. We're all divided up in... Our states are all down, divided up in counties. So you guys are divided up in counties. I'm breaking my head now, ain't I? Is that 25? It's 25. Alright. There we go. House number 8. Let's do that. Hit me with an 8K. Actually, no. Don't hit me with an 8K. Hit, hit me with something else, actually. Hit me with a, yeah, hit me with 12, maybe possibly $12,000. Okay. 12,000. F me, 13,000. Try again, 13,5. Good. Yeah. Okay, that's done. Next. Okay, down the road. We are the United Kingdom of Great Britain, England, Scotland, and Wales, and North Ireland. By the way, it kind of also talks about, like, what's going on. Because, like, I mentioned in, in a stream a couple of 
this was like a like maybe last week i said that the uk didn't have mountain dew and a lot of people said that we are from the uk they say yeah we didn't we don't have mountain dew but then you go to like ireland north ireland i i heard from people from north ireland like or from ireland i should say they said they do have mountain dew so the uk does have mountain dew i don't know what is going on over there let's clean this place I guess it kind of makes sense if you guys, I guess if you look, if you back out of it, right? If you back out of it, it does make sense, right? Some places in the UK have things, some places in the UK don't, right? Okay. Yeah. It's kind of like here, some places here have things, some places there don't have things, right? Yeah. You know what I mean? stuff like that of course we have mountain dew see ireland and northern ireland are two different places oh my god was it like north dakota south dakota south carolina north carolina is it because there's no time that we're not going to actually get the cleaner to do this ireland is not in the uk but north ireland is is that what you're telling me Oh, Jesus. Is that what you're going to tell me right now? Okay, this is not... I think it's because the time is not running. So we might have to clean this ourselves. Can't hire anybody at nighttime. That's a B. North Ireland is part of the UK. Southern Ireland is not part of the UK. What in the world? What will happen there? How come you guys didn't get South... <laughs> Why did Ireland have to split up? How come you couldn't get the, the, the full piece of the pie? You had to only get half of it? What happened to the South, man? Did we not talk about the South? I'm sorry. Did I just hit a touchy subject? <laughs> this is something I'm well not aware of. I Y'all don't have... Y'all don't have Mountain Dew. You don't have Baja Blast at Taco Bell in the UK. You give me a reason why that is. Because that makes no sense. How can you have a Taco Bell and not have Baja Blast? That's the whole... That's 50% of the reason why you go to Taco Bell. Somebody stole my bed. 50% of the reason. Healthy decisions, maybe? Don't you guys drink at the age of 18? Come on. Isn't the drinking age limit 18 years old? Come on. Whoops, I didn't want to do that. I want to do the bed. Too much sugar? You guys are worried about sugar? You guys are worried about sugar? You're worried about sugar? Drinking age is 18. You worry about sugar and you charge people for public restrooms? What? Even you can't even do the public restroom charge fee. You're going into a TJ Maxx and using the bathroom for free because you don't want to have to pull out change to use the public bathroom. You're going to pretend to be a customer, walk in and be like, yeah, this is cool stuff. Can I use your bathroom? And they're like, yeah, are you a customer? And you're like, yeah, sure. And then you just walk out after you're done because you didn't want to pay the toll fee to use a public bathroom. Too much sugar. Too much sugar. I'll show you too much sugar. That's why you don't want to have one of the greatest soft drinks of all time. All right. Very well. Fine. Your decision, not mine. Just 12K, 15K. 10k huh a lot cheaper than i was expecting i'll be honest with you all right fine 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 10k <clears throat> alcohol is sugar alcohol look you worry about sugar look at alcohol 
sugar. Too much sugar. Too much sugar. Too much sugar. That's like if that's like if a, a restaurant said, Yeah, we're not serving alcohol today. Why? Too much sugar. You can choose to have the drink or you can choose not to have the drink. Too much sugar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alcohol is definitely sugar. It definitely is sugar. Too much sugar. Alcohol helps with metabolism. What? I mean, you're... That's like fighting two pro... That's like fighting two cons with one pro. You know what I mean? Hey, smoking's bad for you. It could lead to cancer, but it could also, you know, give you really bad teeth, really bad breath, really stink up your clothes. However, it will make you feel relaxed for 10 minutes because the nicotine hits, baby. Huh? Smoking's bad for you, but we do it because it's, you know, relieves a little bit of stress. Drinking is bad for you, but we do it because it relieves a little bit of stress. It's substances that we consume. And you're telling me Mountain Dew is above all of those substances? What the hell are you on? <laughs> what are you on about? You're bringing a wrong debate here. Just different culture? Well, it is. That's basically what it boils down to now, isn't it? <laughs> it is. I don't want to put that chair there, actually. Wine is definitely part of your five a day. It's like that old lady, that old lady that lived to be 100 years old that she's like, they asked her, I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about. I think she was like 101, 102 or something. Maybe even older than that. And they asked her the secret to life. Maybe she lived to be 110 for all I know. They asked her, what is the secret to life and how do you live so long? And her answer was, I drink a Dr. Pepper every single day. That was her answer. She had 110 years of experience and somebody that asked her the one and most important questions of all time, how can you prolong your life? She says, because I have a Dr. Pepper every single day, makes you feel really small about the world. <laughs> like, oh, shit, all right. I get you. Obviously, we probably know that's not the truth, but I'm just saying. I mean, she she said it, so that's what she believes. So if you want to believe that you can't get a Baja Blast at Taco Bell because it has 30 grams more or maybe 20 grams more sugar than your actual Coke or Pepsi that you're getting at your local Taco Bell, then so be it. So be it. You remember that? Yeah, see? You remember that. <sighs> Peppered Farm remembers. Um, I don't know exactly what I want to put in here. Everything you eat and drink is made with sugar, so if you want us to stop with sugar, they need to stop doing sugar and everything. It's true, unless, you know, we're all just fed water and plants. But yeah. I think it's just, I, I don't know. There's a part of me of a hypocr hypocrisy that's kind of like, I don't know, some sort of weirdness is happening where it's like, yeah, we don't do that drink because it's too sugary. I just don't buy it. There's something else there. And I know the UK is very sensitive about dyes and things like that, right? I, it's just like, why, what? <laughs> I, it's like even hard for me to wrap my head around. Like, wait a sec, huh? You think that's going to stop, you know, health crisis? Who knows? Maybe somebody wasn't going to rob a bank that day because they were happy that they got a Baja freeze. You know what I mean? Maybe they're like, you know what? I was going to rob a bank today, but you know what? Instead, this Baja freeze made me very happy. 
I'm not gonna rob a bank today. We could be saving lives out there, people. That's all I'm saying. Think about it. Think about it. You don't have to think too hard. Just think a little. There we go. There we go. <sighs> Soda makes you happy. See, if it makes you happy, enjoy the happy. Be happy. Be happy. Be happy. Be as happy as long as you can. That's that's I guess the, the best the best advice someone could ever give. Be as happy for as long as you possibly can. Be as happy for as long as you possibly can. Because sometimes, sometimes we tend to forget that this life we live is very, very temporary. Isn't it? Very. This piece of existence will only happen for X amount of time. And then before you know it, we'll never know each other again. <laughs> so just be as happy for as long as you can. That's it. That's all. That's all I have for you. Mm -hmm, madam. That's it. Uh, let me get a lamp. Bedside table. Weed makes me happy. Makes you happy. There you go. That's all you have to do. Just enjoy that. Oh, wait. There might be too much sugar in weed. No. <laughs> JK. <laughs> now I'm being cheeky now, ain't I? You get the diet weed. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. This is house 37. House 37. Why do I feel like I have to, like, I've been, like, I don't know. To me, I feel like I've, like, had to, like, re-up all my houses of furniture, which is very obnoxious, to say the least. Okay, too much. 6,200. Okay. Let's go check on the other houses. Make sure they... Hopefully, they all are ready to go. Okay. Torturing my favorite streamer makes me happy. See? Whatever makes you happy. <laughs> Just live it. Live it and love it. Live it and love it and don't list it. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. This house right here. Does it have furniture in it? Is it clean? It's not clean, but it does have furniture and it's not missing any furniture. Okay, good. Let's go. Okay, it is missing furniture. So it seems like the furniture counter thing might not be working correctly. Because I am obviously missing furniture. You, be, you may be happy to know there is a UK petition out there for bringing Baja Blast to Taco Bell UK. It's a license problem, you believe? Hey, there you go. If it's a license problem, then ha ha ha. The people that are like too much sugar. Because again, I don't believe it. I don't think that's what it is. But a licensing problem? Yeah, I could probably, I could probably believe that. Something corporate, right? There's something different. It, it, it's just impossible for me to think that it's a sugar thing with all the other crap out there, man. But yeah, petition. I I, I, I should sign the petition. I'm not even from the UK, but I'll, I'll sign the petition. I'll sign it. Send me a link. Boom. Done. Did I over furniture it? I mean, I mean, there could be a possibility that I did, but I don't know why I would. There we go. 
Okay. Good thing we have a desk, though. We have an extra desk. Oh, this is the guy I'm suing in the game. That's true. Do I not have an extra desk? I don't have an extra desk. Oh, gosh darn it. Yeah, because this is our brand new desk. Yeah, this is... Yeah, this is... Sorry, this is our brand new house that we just furnished in this stream alone. Right? We just furnished this. And we made sure we put exactly 20 into it. So I think the counting is wrong in, in this now. Damn it. Very well. You've already signed that petition? That's hilarious. We'll make you an honorary UK person for the day so you can sign the petition. That's incredible. Look, I know you can make homemade Baja Blast. It's not the same though. Trust me, I've done it. I get it. Blue Powerade, Mountain Dew, Baja Blast. Yeah, but like, the, it's like, it's like getting a, a, a bottle of Coke versus a can of Coke versus a fountain of Coke. You know what I mean? All three of those taste different. They do. Which one, which one tastes the best? Is it the bottle of Coke? Is it the can of Coke? Or is it the fountain Coke? I need to buy a desk is what I need to do. I've never played Oxygen Not Included. I heard good things about it, though. Bitch. It does not sound like Baja Blast. I know it doesn't sound like it, but it definitely is. Just about the formula. Can of Coke is superior? Really? Interesting. Now, are you saying that because you drink the Coke out of the can? Or are you the person that uh, pours the can of Coke into a glass of ice? <laughs> How superior is it? <laughs> oh, baby. Hit me. All right. You drink from the can? So do I sometimes most of the time I like to drink the coke out of the can I'm a coke over Pepsi guy any day Danielle's a Pepsi lady though I'll just hit that guy in the groin coke or Pepsi I prefer Pepsi I prefer coke but Danielle prefers Pepsi she likes Pepsi there's bills in this okay very well Gotta worry about bills. Here we are. Back to hammering. You just opened a can of Coke and poured it into a glass as you were talking about it. Hmm. Pepsi Max Cherry. We don't have that. We don't have Pepsi Max Cherry, but they did give us recently, they announced here in the United States, they did announce uh, Pepsi Zero Cherry. So I guess that's the same thing. Almost. Possibly. I don't know if there's like different ingredients in it. Maybe the aspartame, 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 aspartame is uh, definitely loaded up. It's too much sugar. Look at aspartame. Look how much aspartame you're consuming. Too much sugar. Look at that. Yeah. What Pepsi flavor do you guys have? Pepsi, Diet Pepsi, Zero Pepsi, or Pepsi Zero. And then, uh, like, flavored Pepsi. But we don't have Pepsi Max. But I'm assuming Pepsi Zero Cherry is the, the, is the Pepsi Max Cherry? I don't know. I don't know. It could be a licensing issue. Or you could argue, oh, how could you guys not have Pepsi Max? Well, maybe we have, to, maybe it has too much aspartame in it. No, that's ridiculous to think. Maybe it's a licensing issue, not because it has too much sugar. I should have posted the other things on the, uh, on the advert, I will admit. We do have mango Pepsi. There 
used to be uh, back in the day there used to be a pepsi that i really really liked it was like around for like a year i think it was called like pepsi blue lightning that pepsi was like one of the best pepsis i ever had does anybody know what i'm talking about pepsi blue lightning 11 days 6200 i want this home take it okay how can i help you want to rent this house for 26 days Ten thousand a day what a luck it's in your budget good okay want to rent this home for six days i really don't like the shortness there but i'll take it i guess there we go all right very good look pepsi is one of those weird drinks right we all say compare pepsi and like coke nowadays right but honestly pepsi didn't even exist until like the 90s right or like the 80s the late 80s or 90s that's when pepsi like became a thing it's a very 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 early stage very early year soft drink if you want to compare it to like root beer or like coke you know what i mean uh let's see here let me go map okay that one that one okay this one okay right next to us let's not mention fanta unless you talk about the commercials in the early 2000s then all in baby uh let's actually go here whoops let's go cue to cleaning clean this all up Thank you. We'll wait for a sec. You go to is Dr. Thunder, which is like Dr. Pepper, but much better, better. Dr. Thunder tastes way. Okay. So I think Dr. I don't drink Dr. Pepper. Danielle likes Dr. Pepper. I don't drink Dr. Pepper, but uh, Dr. Thunder is like a softer, sweeter Dr. Pepper for sure. I don't drink Dr. Pepper only because it's like too sweet for me. Um, let's go Q to this. Perfect. You 12, 12, 5 again. 12, 5 again. Yeah. Okay, so if you remember back Coke and Pepsi back in the 80s, then that must have been when Pepsi was a thing. Became a thing was the 80s. Because they did the whole uh, Pepsi point thing as well during the 90s, I think. Right? The Pepsi points. To like boost up like oh look at this is what pepsi is and then the one thing they did in the 90s too is they did the very very uh provocative like sexy women drinking pepsi like half naked women drinking pepsi was that an american thing or was did you guys see that in uk anyways in the america that we live in uh there was like very very like half naked women drinking pepsi in the 90s so we were like oh dude that's yeah that i want a piece of that you know what i mean so they had like some sort of it's like marketing like carl's jr carl's jr did the same thing in the early 2000s where carl's jr was like oh let's put a girl in the skimpiest bikini and just have her grab a carl's jr burger and just plaster it all over her tatas that's america marketing right there for you yeah that's america marketing You want a piece of that, huh? I'm saying I want a piece of the Pepsi. That's what I'm saying. That's what they were thinking. They said, screw the Pepsi points, but then also they wanted a Pepsi points too. But by the way, thank you, Sierra. Sierra Madre for following on Twitch. Hello. Sierra Madre follow. That's, I like the name. I approve. This is going on. Um... What was it? House number 62. Oh, yeah. That's so far away, isn't it? Yeah, we'll do. We'll go to house number 62. We know where that's in. That's in the new district. That's in Soho. Let's grab some. Uh, let's grab some furniture before we go there first. Skirt. Is Hooters still a thing? Absolutely. It's a fantastic establishment. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's a great establishment for deep fried pickles and uh, wings. 
Yes, yes. That's right. That's right. Her wings. Danielle threatened me. She was. She said she was gonna go to Hooters without me. I said, "How dare you?" I think you guys were there in that stream. This was like a couple months ago, I believe. Some of you were in that stream. Get more of that. I think I might need. Did I get a bed? I need a bed. Okay. Grandfather clock. Hello, Danielle. I'm not ignoring you. I, I wonder if that's the winds calling. That was a massive buff buffer right there. Did you see that? We like lost connection for like half a second. More than half a second. That was crazy. We did lose connection though. I saw it. Is, the, is it the weather telling me something? <clears throat> I just realized these are zero dollars. Why are these zero dollars? Okay. Can I just put like a house full of refrigerators? These are zero dollars. Okay. How is like Pepsi, Pepsi? I gotta look this up. There's no way Pepsi came that early or was that early. No freaking way. I gotta look this up. Pepsi? 1893? When was... Pepsi invented. Oh. Son of a bitch. It was by someone named Caleb, too. It came in 1893 as Brad's Drink. It wasn't called Pepsi. It was called Brad's Drink. Made by Caleb Bradham. <sighs> of course. Of course it was. Why wouldn't it be? So then, Pepsi... What? Took a shot in the dark with Pepsi Crystal? What the hell is that? I'm gonna make a Sears out of all these fridges. You're drinking Brad right now? That is, uh... <laughs> what, dude? Oh, you gotta be careful how you say that. That's Brad's juice? Oh, shit. It was clear Pepsi. Pepsi Crystal. Was it sweet? I never had Pepsi Crystal, believe it or not. Was it like a sweet Pepsi? Ba -da -da, da -da -da -da. I bet the Pepsi was from a little cocaine too. Well, that was Coke. Unless they use something else. Pepsi was like, yeah, you guys are gonna you guys are gonna use Coke. We're gonna use something else. We're gonna use Brad's juice instead. Instead of cocaine. Ah! That's what we're gonna do. The 61. Is it 63? 62. 62. 62. 62. Coke's using cocaine. We're going to use Brad's juice. Watch out. This is going to be a Sears. We're going to put a bunch of fridges in here. What the hell? Wait, is this a fridge? Wait. What is this? What? I beg your pardon. What is this? It's a refrigerator. Right. Okay. All right. I don't. Are these broken? 
Do these not work? Okay. Huh? The refrigerator, isn't it? Is that not a refrigerator? Oh my effing god. What is this? What is this contraption? Okay, look, maybe that's why they're free. Okay, I just bought a bunch of free fridges for no reason. Those are broken fridges. <sighs> maybe that's why they were free. I wonder if they have collision to them. What about this fridge? Is this fridge good? Nope, that's broken too. They put broken fridges in the game. Sick. Could it be a bug? Um, maybe. It's definitely a bug. Definitely a bug. But, but they're also, I don't know. It could be permanently broken. What the frick is this? I can't put this in either. What is this? Is this a fridge too? What is this? I think it's all the free items. Yeah, I think all the free items are kind of like broken. That's not a fridge. I don't know what the hell that is. But it's all the free items. <laughs> it's all the new items, I guess. Uh, right. That's broken too. Nice, dude. All right. Maybe it's the area. I would say yes, but we're placing items in the house. You know, like we're placing items normally, but those items in particular are not working. This is a new couch. This is also a broken item. Okay, so note to self, don't get any of the new items. That's supposed to be a couch. Don't get any of the new items because they're all broken. So I'm assuming this is broken too. No, this is right. Okay, cool. Never mind. You can get this new item if you want. Desk. Looks like urinals. Lord. You know what's, uh, you know, like, I'm telling you. I know, like, when did root beer become a thing? Root beer is like the oldest, is it the first soft drink to ever be like this first pop, first soda, whatever you want to call it. Root beer is like the first one to ever be created, right? Sarsaparilla. Was it sarsaparilla? Or was it just legitimately called root beer? What was the first naming of root beer? If Pepsi's first naming was Brad's juice or Brad's drink, then what the hell was root beer? The sarsaparilla, yeah? You love sarsaparilla? Okay. Now, in today's age, if you went and said, oh, give me a sarsaparilla... And they give you a sarsaparilla. Isn't a sarsaparilla just a root beer? Right? Is it just like a fancy way of saying, oh, give me a root beer? Is it the same drink? Or are they different drinks? Is it like comparing like Sprite to 7-Up? Do you guys have Sprite or 7-Up in the UK? was ginger beer, right? Birch beer, ginger beer, was a ginger beer. I remember there being a ginger beer, yeah?
You have both Sprite and 7-Up? Well, at least you have that. I'm more of a Sprite liker than a 7-Up liker. Sprite's more king. Indeed. Sarsaparilla is a root. Thus, the root beer. So then, if you say, I love sarsaparilla, you love root beer. Right? Do you have tango in the U.S.? What the hell is tango? I mean, we can dance the tango, if that's what you mean. Is that what you mean? A strong McDonald's Sprite. Okay, listen here. A McDonald's Sprite is one of the... What would you call it? McDonald's Sprite is like the Holy Grail. Nothing comes close in the world of the soft drink economy comes close to a large Sprite with extra ice. And I know you folks in the UK say, how dare you have ice in your drink? Look, first of all, that argument's ridiculous and I'm not going to do that one again. Okay. How dare you not to have ice in your drink? It waters down the drink. You get less liquid. Look, first and foremost, more is not always good. Less is sometimes more. And if you're going to tell me it waters down the drink, I'm going to tell you to shut up and drink your drink so the ice doesn't melt. Okay? There's no argument. There's nothing there. There's no debate about it. That's what it is. 5,000. 5,200. We have ice in our drinks? I don't believe it. You have ice in your drink? I had ice in my Pepsi today at Nando's. Is this a European thing then? Is it not a UK thing? Is it an EU thing? Is this an EU thing that I'm thinking of? You know you have to go somewhere over there in, in that continent. You have to go and be like, yes, can I have ice in my drink? Is that France? Is it in the EU? Sorry, I say European thing. I know you Brits are European as well, but you know what I mean. They use more, they use more syrup. You think they use more syrup? And they're over there, too much sugar, right? Got it. This is sick. <laughs> Love that. Backside of water. Eighth wonder of the world. Here I am. It's an EU thing, yeah? Look, I know you go to France and you they don't give you ice in your in your cup. I know it. It's a known thing. Go to France. I don't even have to go to France to know that's a thing. Maybe you should take the bridge to the EU. You know, where they all drive on the right side of the road. You know what I mean? You know, you know what I mean? They might not know how to, they might not know how to like, you know, put ice in drinks, but they know how to drive on the right side of the road. Yeah, frickin' fracks. I would like to take money from you. Twenty two hundred, I'll take it. Thank you, wife. I'm on a roll today. I know. I think I'm just a little extra cheeky because I know I'm gonna get F tomorrow morning. In a very broad sense of climate and not physically. Well, maybe physically. Mentally physically. You know what I mean. Wind winds yes. I'm at the, uh, I don't give a, I don't give a, I'm at the point where I'm just like, send me at this point. Just send me. Mm. Is that my game wife? That is my game wife. Somebody has to be from the EU and be like, yo, 
Hands is right. We don't put ice in our drinks. And we give out five pieces of chicken nuggets. Oh, damn. I put that in the wrong one. And we give out five pieces, five piece chicken nuggets at McDonald's. Somebody has to be there. We have to have something. <clears throat> If Italy is handing out five piece chicken nuggets, then you know they're not giving any ice in their drinks. Why the F? What, what the F are you talking about? I'll give you 5,000. Get rejected, sweetheart. Good day to you. Next, 9,000, please. Five days. Hate it. Unfortunately, that's over your budget. Have a nice day. Good day. <clears throat> uh, 5,200 for 11 days. Yep. Luckily, it's cheap. Very Lisa good. Lisa of SP became a member. Thank you, Screech Owl, for gifting a membership to Lisa. Hello. That was very kind of you. How are you? Good to see you. That was very kind. Hello. My apologies. 23 days. The house is 12,000. Fantastic. Oh, that's a wonderful uh, send there. Thank you. You? Want to rent the house for five days? Hate that. 9,000. What the F are you talking about? Look here, old lady. Don't say that to me. All right. Good day to you. We have another customer coming in. I studied in France for three months, but I don't remember the ice thing. Is this going to be like a, 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 a Google again? In the Netherlands, you have to ask for ice unless it is warm summer days. Then most cafes will serve soda with ice. I want ice all the time. Why is she so naked? I don't know why these people are half naked. I don't know why the developers decided to, to make people naked in this game. Maybe for entertainment purposes, for me to react to it. I have no idea why they, why they have uh, half naked people in this world. I have no idea. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. I will not drink soda or water unless it's very cold or at least has ice in it. I've asked this question before. I know there's people that prefer ice cold water and like room temperature water. I cannot do room temperature water. There's something about the taste that just doesn't... Does it taste... Is it just me or does it taste different? You know what I mean? Okay, five days. Fine, I'll do it. it, it it's just like room temperature water compared to like ice water. There's like a... There's like a... There's a taste difference there, I feel like. 58,000. We're going to hit a million dollars. We have $988,000. Very well. It tastes thick. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Screech Out, for the super chat. Do they know more? They chat higher profile. I'll be honest with you. I don't know what that means, but thank you for the super chat. Nonetheless, there it is. Room temperature water. Do they know more? They chat higher profile. What? <laughs> room temperature water is much better for you. What are you talking about? Room temperature? Don't give me this. You're going to feed Hi, me BS subscribe. again, aren't you? By the way, thank you for subscribing. Jan K. Appreciate that. Are you going to feed me BS once again? You're going to be like, oh, cans. Room temperature water is better for you than ice water. Don't even, don't even start. It's freaking water. Room te temperature water is the best unless I'm outside in the heat. Man, no nice, no ice needed. Man, there's a lot of people that like room temperature water. Man, like even if I go to like the, the faucet and you like put the... You know, glass of water. I can't do that, dude. I need to like get the ice, put the ice in the cup, then put the water in the in the cup to go along with it. I think I can get this. Uh, sit here, three thirty k. Shit.
One million dollars. One million dollars. We did it. I'm gonna go buy a farm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. My ex used to leave a water pitcher out of the fridge all the time. It drove me nuts. Yeah, that is just bad housekeeping. Or that's bad. I don't know what the hell that's called, but that's bad something. You don't do warm water like that. I mean, room temperature water. Like, come on now. Do I own the farm? I'm about to own this freaking farm. We're about to hit the 1 million jackpot here. Ice, then drink. Everything in the world, ice, then drink. Hello, sir. Hello. Hi, what are you doing here? What can an, what can an old man do? I'm just sitting. Do you own this farm? Yes, but I'm selling it. I'm too old. How much is it? I'll sell it to you for $1 million. I'll take it. Love the banjo. Water first, then ice. It's kind of like the conversation of like, by the way, I have $600. It's kind of like the conversation of like, what do you do when you like have cereal? Yeah. You know what I mean? Wait, do, do we get to own this house? Is this our house? Oh, this is our house. Okay. All right. So this is our house. Uh, let's actually go to sleep and then we'll get our money in the morning. It's kind of like cereal. It's like, what do you do? Do you add the cereal cereal in first, then milk on top? Or do you add milk in first, then cereal on top, right? What do you do? I have zero dollars. Cereal, then milk. That's what I do. Cereal definitely goes first, then milk. Milk first. What? Milk first? You're out of your mind. I agreed with you when you said ice, then water, but then you turn around and say cereal. cereal uh, you say milk first, then cereal. What the frick? I'm sorry. Cereal, then milk. The frick? Crazy, man. Milk before cereal is insane behavior. <laughs> That's like insane. <laughs> oh, damn, dude. Drink the cereal milk at the end, too? No. No drinking of the cereal milk. That is disgusting. Okay, now that we have this son of a gun. Farm store. Hello, Eric. How are you? I want to buy new items. Okay. Give me chicken. Give me sheep. Give me fence. I don't know how this works. I'm going to put fences anywhere. Oh, cool. Oh, I see. I see. I put the chicken thing in there. Yeah, probably. The cereal milk is chunky. Oh, literally makes me want to gag. Ugh. I can't drink anything with chunks in it. Me neither. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is for chickens, I guess. Even melted ice cream. No, thank you. I'm not having a bowl of ice cream and then slurping up the, uh, no. Nope. Nope. Sorry. Sorry. Nope. 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 No boba. I mean, oh, that's different. Boba tea's different. That's different. Come on, that's a cheap shot. That's a that's different. <clears throat> what is this? Food for the chickens? It's called ice cream soup? Yeah, that is disgusting. <laughs> 
Goodness gracious. Okay. Hello, Casey Lee. How are you? I wish these things snap because I'm not going to be able to draw a straight line. I'll be honest with you. Uh, slurping up the ice cream. How dare you? You're definitely a cereal then milk kind of person. How do you know how much milk to put in in the cereal if it isn't first right? I agree. Now, okay, I'm the type of person. Okay, you guys might be disgusted with me. And you know what? Whatever. So be it. You could be disgusted with me. I'm not disgusted with me. That's what matters. I'm the kind of person that does not get a bowl for their cereal. Like, I don't get your regular standard bowl for the cereal. I'm not using your regulars. Like, I'm not using a regular standard bowl. Like, I'm getting the biggest bowl. I'm getting a mixing bowl. I'm getting a container. I'm getting tubbleware. You know what I mean? I'm not getting a cereal bowl. I'm getting... I'm, if I'm if I'm having cereal, it's a meal, not a, a tease. You understand? That's what I'm doing. I'm having half of the box right there. Yeah, right then and there. That's right. I said Tupperware with two B's, two capital B's to go along with that too. Yeah. I don't mean Tupperware. I mean Tupperware. I know what I said. This is that hurts my head. <laughs> oh no. Ah, oh, look at this farm. It's already at a friggin' angle, isn't it? Oi, oi, oi. We fill it up. There we go. I usually eat it out of the box when I have it dry. No milk ever. You know, I used to do that, but it really... Um, I used to do that too. I used to eat it dry, but I, it really messed up my teeth. So... I stopped doing that. But if I were to choose like a cereal to eat dry, what cereal would you eat dry? I would. Do you guys have Apple Jacks in the UK? I would eat Apple Jacks dry. That would be like my dry run. If I was feeling like, oh, yeah, I'm too lazy to put the put the milk in the bowl and the bowl in the milk or I don't have any mixing bowls or tubbleware to actually use. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Cheerios dry? Cocoa Puffs dry? Lucky Charms dry? Ooh, the Lucky Charms, the marshmallows, that would hurt my teeth. Cinnamon Crunch dry? Cheerios are good? Are good dry? Cheerios, I feel like, are very, like, no disrespect to anybody. <laughs> no disrespect. I feel cherry Cheerio Cheerios Cheerios the cereal Cheerios is a is a is a cereal you buy when you're like you've hit that threshold of like 40 years old you're like okay I'm 40 years old I only have two options now I either have Raisin Bran or I have Cheerios I feel, I feel like that's what happens when you turn 40 years old is that right can anybody correct me or can someone just tell me I'm flat out wrong? There we go. Double fence it, I guess. Let's see if we can buy animals. Raisin Bran isn't bad. It's not bad, but it's like definitely like something you're like, yeah, I'll have this like maybe once every six months. I'm flat out wrong. See, you tell me I'm flat out wrong makes me believe that I'm flat out right. You know what I mean? My son is obsessed with Cheerios. <laughs> Unless they have some sort of like black market on you guys and have you attached to the Cheerio train. I, I always remember my grandparents always having Cheerios 
or mini mini frosted flakes mini frost okay i like mini frosted or frosted flakes you know what i mean mini mini frosted flakes but definitely like cheerios was like something you i definitely saw at my grandma's house or like my grand my grandfather's house i was like oh what do you have for cereal this morning i have cheerio cheerios and fiber one all right i'll take the cheerios you know what i mean Oh wait, the farm's not down here. This is the horse one. I don't think I can actually go to the farm because it's late. All right, we'll sleep and then we'll get to the farm uh, things. You've been eating since 12 years old? You just like it? <laughs> somebody, somebody had to introduce you to it young. That's what it is. I'm 52 and I love life cereal. Okay, life cereal is a banger. That's a very good cereal. I agree. Life cereal is a very good cereal. That's a cereal I can get behind. 100%. You have all those sugar cereals and you hated them? <laughs> as soon as you turn 40, the doctor says the only thing you can eat is Cheerios. <laughs> it's like the cholesterol thing, right? It's like you always see like the... Uh, the, uh, the, the, that, well, the, the, I guess maybe that's part due to advertisement, right? Maybe that's just how, um, Cheerios have advertised themselves. They've advertised themselves as like a, ooh, you know, low cholesterol type, like, uh, you know, try, you want to try to be healthy, try us, you know what I mean? Something like that. Maybe that's what it is. Don't get the food conversation when I'm trying to leave. <laughs> it's like 98% of the content that I produce here on YouTube is co food conversations. Full English now? No, that's a breakfast. Great nut, grape nuts on yogurt is amazing. I don't think I've ever had grape nuts. But I don't think I've ever had yogurt for breakfast either. Love, love grape nut ice cream. What the frick? I've never heard of that either. Hello. I'm here to buy a chicken. I think. Hello. Oh my God. Where am I supposed to put this in the trunk? Oh, sorry. What? Huh? What? Wait, how do I take this back with me? Do I have to walk all the way home? Don't tell me I have to walk all the way home with a chicken in my hand. Did I win my lawsuit? That's a very good question. Did I eat the chicken into my uh, Ford Raptor? Possibly. Reese's Puff are awesome. Reese's Puff, Reese's Puff. Eat them up, eat them up, eat them up. I've never had Reese's Puff. I've heard the commercial 20,000 times, but I've never had the cereal. I need to buy the truck? All right. This is disappointing. You need to buy the actual like farm truck? Park in the box? That was a sellable area. I don't want to sell my chicken. Can I ride a horse and can I ride a horse and carry a chicken? I forgot there's bedding at the horse track too. Have a good one, Velvet. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Oh, there it is right there. How much is the truck? 50,000. Okay, we have a chicken in the back, dude. All right, very well. Let's go get more. Every vehicle is equipped with NOS in this game. <sighs> have a good night. Screech out. Oh, goodness. Have a good night. Do take care. Is it a ghost chicken? Possibly. 
Scoot. Give me that chicken. Can I put as many animals as I want in this truck? Nice. Give me more chickens. Give me all the chickens. Now, do the chickens produce eggs? Do we get any, like, anybody that has played this? Serious question. Is this, like, a profitable thing that I'm doing here, or is this all for decorations? Like, is there any gameplay out of this that I'm getting? Can I get a sheep in there? Locked? Oh. Wait. Why? Farm skills? <gasps> oh, I see. I see. What is this? You can milk and eggs by feeding animals. Thank you. Corn sunflower wheat. Once the seeds have opened, they can now be purchased from the seed shop. Hell yeah, brother. Okay, sheep. Give me the sheep. Your land will expand by one level. Okay, I see now. Um, give me that as well. Cool. Give me the sheep. $5,000 for this thing. Well, I guess that makes sense. It's a sheep. I don't know the actual going rate for chickens in real life. Nice. So we can milk the sheep and we can lay the eggs or get eggs from the uh, freaking chickens. Got it. Cool, dude. Hello, Matt and Do. How are you? All right. Let's go. We have chickens and we have sheep. We have chickens and sheep. Is this corn hub? I don't think corn hub exists anymore. I don't think that's a website that exists anymore. Not even upset about what I just did. Hello, farm people. I'm back. I have friends. There you go. There you are. Nice. This is cool, dude. Adult chickens are expensive. Like, female ones, right? Not males. I would assume female ones, right? Hens? I don't know. Maybe a rooster is expensive. I guess it depends on, like, breeding and all that, right? It's true. There you go. Corn hub is still there. Did you just look that up? There we go. Okay. So they'll do their thing. And I guess we'll get like stuff from them. Now about planting stuff. Let's see. Hello. I want to buy plant stuff. This guy wearing Crocs. Wow, those are way bigger than I was expecting. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I thought they were going to be a lot smaller. Okay. All right. Very well. It's a felony hit and run on a police car. It's very true. Could even be counted as attempted murder, too. $25 for a hen in real life or so. More for designer birds. See, put the wheat or put the food back here put the plants back here everything is not lined up correctly and it's driving me nuts the devs did not line up this uh good on the grid especially when they have a system that's a snapping system there we go they did not line up their building placements or anything perfectly on the grid i don't think hey oh The stress to the chickens and sheep should be one, two. Must have missed something there. There we are. They're massive. Oh my God, they're huge. I don't think my wife has ever told me that ever at any given time of our stage of any part of any time ever. She's never muddled those words to me at all. Perfect. <laughs> Once I had a rooster that when he would ha do the rooster noises, do it sound like a woman screaming. So they 
so we called him screaming lady first time i heard it freaked me out it would be like something like ah! something like that is that what a rooster does there we go that is not lined up oh dare i line this up There we go. That was exactly it. Thank you. I should be a chicken. Or a rooster. Oh, you bastard. Very well. 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 I want to put... Uh, what the hell did I want to put? Uh, let's put... Tomato. No. Cucumber. No. Yes. That. Tomatoes. Tomato. Cucumber. Corn. No. Tomato. Corn. Sunflowers in the front. Sunflowers in the front. Nice. Do we have to water these? Oh. Water. Three days to grow. There we go. Perfect. The soil already looks watered, but here we are. My friends are probably like, where the hell is Vega? She said she was getting ready over an hour ago. Whoops. Uh... <laughs> do, do not blame it on me. Do not blame it on me. Blame it on chat. Be like, I was talking to like some people in this like form of chat this chat form and I, it was not reddit but i was just talking to these people and we got lost in the sauce because we were talking about ice cube water not the wrapper ice cubes water uh milk cereal uh mountain dew sugars it's uh, it was just, it was, just say it was an incredible discourse is what it was yeah that's all you have to say nothing else nothing else just that just that Okay, new item. Boom. Boom. Perfect. Good job. He says tomato so beautifully when he says it right. Absolutely not. You don't say potato right. If I don't say tomato right, you don't say potato right. In your terms of language speaking. If you tell me that you say a tomato and then you don't say a potato, you're the one that's wrong here. That's called inconsistency is what that's called. You say a tomato and then you say potato. That is inconsistency, people. Learn about it. Read about it. Write about it. See, this is not lined up. See how this is not lined up on the grid? So there's not really much I can do about it. There we go. Corn. And corn. Water. Water. Hello, Mark. How's it going? What's going on? There we go. It's sprouting up. It's just cold and I'm avoiding leaving so I, as long as I can. Yeah, if it's cold outside and you don't want to go, F it. Don't go outside. <laughs> I totally get that. Wait a sec. Did someone just ring me? Helicopter circling above us. Is there something going on right now in our area? All right. I'm done for today. I'm done for notifications. Just let me turn my phone off. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're not going to let me leave in peace tonight, are they? They're going to have me worrying about my damn home this entire time I'm away. Ah, <sighs> right. Um, right. Okay, that's good. That's good. Let's go to, let's go to the casino, baby. There's a helicopter circling above our house. Oh, and by the way, you're going to get 65 miles an hour of wind tomorrow. Thanks. 
Appreciate that. Thought you were leaving in the morning? Well, I'm flying out in the morning, but I'm leaving tonight. I'm driving to Sacramento tonight. And then I'm leaving in the morning uh, in Sacramento. I don't live in Sacramento. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I can see that it doesn't line up well or even flush with the others. They are a bit off. Yeah, they are very off on that. At least I know they're probably off the grid is what they are. They're really off on the grid. Thank you. $211. All right. Through the casino in style. Let's go. I'm getting notification stresses here. I am. I'm freaking out. Like, why is everything deciding to like hit us now? What's the dealio? I don't do jack ish all year of 2024. And then I decide to step outside my house for one time, one time, leave my house and there and all hell breaks loose. That's it. I would like to buy your car. <sighs> this is a car worth more than it looks. You can't buy my car with this money. Well, what do you have? I have to do. To, what do I have to do to buy your car? You seem like a smart guy. You can find out the right answer. Yeah, that makes no sense. $50,000. 17. I got nothing to live for now. Stay. I win. Good job. Let's sit next to this redhead. Hello? You don't mind? I'm going to play some slots. Um, right. Where do I max my... Where's the max button? Do I just spin it? Oh, I just spin it. Very well. Why is there a huge horse playing blackjack? Because I put the horse there. That's my horse. I didn't want to keep it at the home. So instead, I kept it at the casino. I'm, I'm honestly what I'm doing is I'm doing some sort of like dangering of like I'm doing the butterfly effect just by leaving the house <laughs> Everybody's screwed <laughs> Not just me <laughs> I just realized you finally bought the farm instead of the past the passing of a relative that leaves you a dump to fix it up Exactly. I actually go out and purchase the farm myself instead of like us having somebody leave us a farm and we have to fix it up. It's perfect. Like every other start of every farming game out there, right? Yeah, exactly. Big money, big money, big money. No whammy. Stop. I like the older version of, uh, what was it called? What was that show called? Um, Press Your Luck. I like the older version, like the 90s. Was it 90s or was it early 2000s? I like that one. I know they have a new one out with like Elizabeth. What's her face? The chick that is in uh, Zack and Miri make a porno That movie She's the host or she was the host For like the new press your luck sh game But I didn't like it as much I like the older one It's like Supermarket Sweep I like Supermarket Sweep eh, I'm not really a fan of Guy Fieri Supermarket Sweep But I like the older one It's kind of messed up though because you go on Amazon Prime. If you go on Amazon Prime, you have Amazon Prime video. You can watch like the old like supermarket sweep seasons and episodes. You go up on there. You go and watch that show and you try to guess the prices of those grocery items. You're going to get screwed up because inflation is an absolute bitch. Hello, Daniel. How are you? What's going on? I like the Drew Carey Price is Right. I like the Drew Carey Price is Right. I like the Drew Carey Whose Line Is It Anyway? I'm not so much a fan of the new Whose Line Is It Anyway. But I like the old Whose Line Is It Anyway. You know what I mean? That's $1,000 right there. There we go. Won our first jackpot. That's an achievement too. I like the Bob Barker transition into the uh, Drew Carey. I 
I think the host for the new, I don't know, I don't know. At least when the when the re the re up of whose line is it anyway? I don't know the host. I don't know if she's still the host, but it's the I forgot her name. Aisha Tyler. I think if I'm pulling that out of somewhere, I think it Aisha Tyler. Now she's the host for whose line is it anyway but she's also like a judge in one of the judge shows i think she was like part of hot bench too was it hosted by elizabeth banks if that's who that is i i can't remember her last name elizabeth banks is that who who uh started that movie too as well for 50k say that's a hundred thousand dollars can you meet me in real life? Where do you live? <laughs> Don't answer that question. <laughs> it is Aisha Tyler. Like she was the she was the judge in Hot Bench. Hit me. Damn it. She was the judge in Hot Bench, and then she like became like the host for that, which kind of threw me off a little bit. I'm like, wait, what? Are you a judge? Don't aren't you? Aren't you kind of busy or are you like a I don't know how those TV judge shows work Like are you a real judge fake judge All I know is like if you watch like Judge Judy or anything Like it's funny that those people like I think what happens is Like it's small claims court right so it's nothing huge Somebody's suing somebody right And I think what happens is if you go on that show The show pays for your legal fees So like if someone's like oh I won $5,000 against this person, you know, like some, like the defendant loses and the plaintiff wins $5,000. I think the show pays $5,000 for the plaintiff to cover the defendant. If that makes any sense, just because they get the content out of them being on TV and being embarrassed by judge Judy. I think that's how it, how it, um, how it uh, goes. Yeah, I think that's how those judge shows work. So like you might be like, oh, yeah You cheated on your wife you scumbag you have to pay five thousand dollars and then really they don't actually pay five thousand dollars Pretty sure that's how that works Do YouTube conventions exist? Uh, there's there's something called vid summit which is like a YouTube convention. Yeah, happens every year. This year it's happening in Dallas. Uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, the Dallas, Fort Worth. Yeah. Yeah. Um, other than that, there's like TwitchCon. TwitchCon happens here soon in the UK, I think, or in Europe somewhere. And then they do an America one in San Diego. Uh, in September, but there's something called Vid Summit. <laughs> I like the Drew Carey show. The Drew Carey show was fun. The only problem is, is that you, it's impossible to find that show. You can't find that show because of all the licensing music in that show. That show had incredible licensing music. Can't find it anywhere. I don't know if it ever went out on like, uh, like on box tape i don't know if they're ever if they ever made like a like a dvd series of that show but if they did i would love to have that show my god mimi is that her name mimi my god hilarious but anyways i hope you all had a wonderful time i'm gonna stop it up there we're about to hit the three hour mark hopefully you had a good time today I had a good time today talking about nonsense and enjoying and coming back to this game of estate agent simulator we did buy the farm and we did build on the motel how do i feel about the motel i think it's cool i think it's a cool concept um it's very it's another passive thing to have it's probably very good to have early on uh later game is eh, you know it's whatever but early on probably fun to have um in the farm i mean we've got a little bit maybe we'll come back again and see what the farm and we'll i'll keep my eye on this game to see if there's any more updates and things like that for sure yeah absolutely you love bb but it's been a pleasure and honor being with you today i hope you all have a wonderful wonderful time and a wonderful weekend and a safe weekend and a safe weekday this is the last stream for the like next week or so so um thank you all for hanging out with me on this last stream uh before my break 
there will be videos coming out all while I'm gone. There'll be a lot of let's look at and first looks because Steam Next Fest is happening. So there's going to be a lot of look at different types of games. And yes, there will be more universe sim. If people are wondering if there's going to be more universe sim, there will be more universe sim as well. And if you are a member, there should be a special live stream coming up uh, during my break as well. So look out for the members live stream that we're going to be doing. I'm going to try to pull off my first IRL live stream for members only. So if you are a member, watch out for that. Should be fun. Anyways, I'm going to go. I got to go and uh, get ready and all that and take about a two and a half hour drive. And uh I guess see how tomorrow goes. If you want to hear me complain more and bitch about more about the economy or about my logistics of traveling, you can join the Discord. Discord's down in the description down below and I can keep you all updated about what happens when uh, when that time comes. Other than that, I will see you all next week, late next week, probably Friday, Thursday, Friday, sometime next week. I'll see you all then live again. And we'll be back with some more games, more streams, more simulators, more fun stuff. All right? All right. Have a great rest of your weekend and great week, everyone. Do take care. Subscriber!